In this video, let's further customize the look of our market analyzer. I'm going to go ahead and add a label row to the market analyzer. I'm going to right click where I want the label row to be. Pop up menu will appear and I'll click on add label row and you can see it says label. Well, I'm going to go ahead and name it. I'll double click on that and I'll type in stock index futures. Hit enter and I've created a section. Now I can find other stock index futures and drag them right underneath the first one, which is the E-mini S&P to create that portion of my market analyzer. I could go ahead and do another label row, right click, add label row, and let's call this treasury futures, hit enter. And then I have my treasury futures. I'll go ahead and move up my, up my 10 year note right underneath the 30 year bonds. And we'll do it one more time. I'll right click and we'll go ahead and add uh, that label roll again. And we'll call this energy futures. I've added that. So now I've added one, two, three categories and I can continue on. And you can see that we have other asset classes that we could add to the market analyzer, but that's a quick, uh, fast way to go ahead and add label rows. Let's go ahead and format some of the colors on the market analyzer. I'm going to go ahead and right click and I'm going to go back to that properties area. Dialog box appears again. And then I'm going to go ahead and change some stuff. The yellow, I don't like the yellow. Row changed highlight background. I'm going to change that to transparent. Hit the drop down menu. Click on the word transparent. We could also change the label row background. I'm going to go ahead and do that from transparent. I don't know. Let's just say we'll make it light blue. Change that, hit apply, hit OK, and we further customize the look and feel of the market analyzer. Thank you for watching and be sure to check out all of our quick tip videos to help you get started with the NinjaTrader desktop platform.